All right, so we have to find a mainframe. Nothing up here, except for this locked, sweet little baby desk. Good lord. Aha! Your cup is mine. Your Batman cup. Okay, let's try to get over there. Really? Ugh. Fine. Okay, mainframe. Guess we're moving up ahead, boys. Oh, hi. Oh, you're Steve. Steve. Well, I don't know where this guy is, everyone, all right? Let's just leave him. Let's just leave him alone. Is he up there? I don't see anything, you guys. You guys are drunk. Let's go. Office, quarters, armory. Let's go to the office. Whoa! Holy. Oh, Jesus! If I could miss anymore, I'd be called Missy McMiss Pants. Oh, God, Jerry, Jesus. Ah, oh, my gun's a piece of crap. Give me those wrenches, give me those bullets, gonna throw your body off of the edge. Ooh. I don't know what I just did. Well, whatever we did, we did it once. And that was all. Okay. Um, was there like something under that? Like, was there like totally something under there? Like, oh my god. Oh my god, you guys. Oh my god, a dead guy? Oh my god. Duct tape! That's what my hands smell like right now because I was using some before. That's right. I duct taped cups to Harvey. He found them the hard way. All right, office, admin suites, yay. Oh my God, I can hear Harvey meowing downstairs. Activate terminal, unlock mainframe door. Please access, please enter access password. All right, everyone, now we have to get the access password. Good Lord. Gotta be in one of these, boys. Cabinets, the mod. Have you ever dreamed of dashing through files and files of cabinets? Well, now your dreams can come true in the new mod, Cabinets. That's right. 38 hours of gameplay of cabinet action. Non-stop drawer flinging open with new custom drawers and even some bedroom floors. Yeah, what? Oh, mushrooms? How about 48 new... Varieties of mushrooms, molded and meshed over 18 years and textured by the greatest mod makers ever. Good, now push Z again to let go of the skull. What? I... let me check something. Oh, I don't. What mod is that? What the hell mod is that? Gonna do the terminal, cause I'm gonna oversee where this goes. PM, potential security breach. Sat down with Spook Dwight York today regarding the disappearance of Damian Green. Surprised to see that Perka was willing to grant York leave to pursue this matter. The bad, the bad to fool are handling this from their end. Nevertheless, I'd advise making internal audit of shipments and metro travel over the last six months. If, as he believed, Green has been ghosting orders onto our system, we need to handle this before it goes public. If possible, I'd like to recommend allowing Spook York to review our records under supervision privately. Please get back to me as soon as possible regarding security. Maintenance request. Can you send me up? Can you send someone up to take a look at this damp? It's seeping in through the wall. And laden in flooding problems for the more. And we've read these. Yes, we did. God darn it. it sure is seepy in here, boys and girls. It sure is seepy. Oh, 
Harvey went outside. Okay. Oh, I can just pick the lock? Well, screw that. I'm a man of my word. And I didn't mention anything about picking this before, but whatever. Damn it, so close. Yes! Take that, computers! Freeze, computer. Where is she? All right. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna... Add biometric data to staff database. Hells yeah, girl. Upgrade clearance to level three. Hey, oh, pre pl please present valid user ID and password network clearance codes. Level three admin clearance required. Ah, oh, piss. In your mouth, what's wrong? This security system isn't as simple as our own. This is only a handful of key cards and they can't be cloned. If we want that data, we're gonna have to find a key card with level three. No, hang on. If we find a level two key card and the right password, we can make a level three key card right here. Okay, not as huge a disaster as I thought. Ball arms is literally always in front of you. So where do we find these key cards? Hang on, let me have a poke at your pit boy again. Stop poking these it. These cards transmit their data wirelessly. If I can triangulate from the scanners, yes. Okay. Your pit boy's tracking the data signature from these key cards. Most of them are in blocked off sections, but this one is moving. I think the vipers might be working on getting this place running after all. Like the, like the people vipers or the viper vipers? Damn right. All right, I'll, I'll accept that. Let's go. Get ready to blast some doors open, cause this summer you're getting breached. Do 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 do. Chaka 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 choo. Boop 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 boop. I'm gonna burp into the microphone like a little girl. Do 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 do. Someone got crushed under here. Foreman's master key. Thank you, Master Chief Key. Oh come on! Seriously? How do you? How? How? Yeah, I agree. All right, everyone, Jesus Christ, we have not seen lava like this for a week at least. And we saw lava, we see lava a lot. All right, guys, um, Super Mario time. Oh, I wish I had a Super Mario mod. Oh, my God, we could put on a red hat and Jerry could put on a green hat. Oh, yeah, Steve, you could, um, you could be Princess Peach and then Borlams would be Bowser. No, 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 it'd be Mr. Cuddles where he'd be Bowser. And Bolams, you would be Toad. Yeah, because nobody likes Toad. All right, wait a minute. Okay, let's go. Oh, and Sky, you could be no one. You could be, uh... Yeah, you could be no one, because no one cares. All right. Nobody fall in the lava. I mean, unless you want to. All right, and then Sky fell in the lava. Great. Oh no, cuddles. Okay. Well, Sky is the only one that fell in the lava. Lava reduction plant. Smelting controls. Tracking lines. Unresponsive. Pressing controls. Nope. User log. Got this all worked out. Panel with the screen. The controls. Those big buckets. Got enough junk here to melt down easy enough. Poured into the hopper with the blue thing or the red one. Both. I'll work it out. And then the lava burned forever. Forever. Oh, Jesus! Jerry, shoot, goddammit. You're all hookers. All of you. Holy shit, that's a lot of hookers. Stop pushing me! Oh, God! Damn it, ball arms! <laughs> I mean, Jerry. God damn it, Jerry. Jerry's just pushing me like, get out of the way, I wanna fight. Did Jerry just... Where did Jerry go? Oh, did Jerry fall in the goddamn lava? Stop shooting me! Nobody likes you or your stupid clothing. Let me just reload real quick. Okay. And so everyone became unconscious. Except for ball arms. Jerry! J Jerry! J Jerry! Ugh. Jerry, I don't want to touch. Oh, God. Oh, and then I died. 
Tell my mother I love her. As the blue and white and red envelop me. Hey, lava's American. It's weird. Or any other country that has those three colors. Which is a lot. Take, for instance, the, um, the Turtle Kingdom. Yeah, they have those colors. Welcome to the Turtle Kingdom. That's what I, that's what they say to you when you go there. It's really informal. Ah! Aha! Oh, Jesus! Sky! Holy! Uh, Jerry, don't fall back. Don't fall back. Ow, okay. Quickly, my pea shooter does nothing. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, what does that guy have? Oh, he's got a flamethrower. Yeah! Take that, you hussy. What else are we shooting at? Are we missing out? Oh, we are. Unless it's ball arms. No, wait. No, yeah, okay. Yeah, I... You guys gotta calm down, alright? Now, that's what I call a calm... Oh! Oh, God! Oh, God! Shut up! Oh, God! Oh, Jesus. Guys, stop, sp stop spooning. Stop spooning. Jesus Christ. I'm just getting warmed up. As he's in a lava pit. How ironic. It's like raining in lava on your face. It's like cool springs of bullets on Sonny's face. You like, dude. Sonny oh, I can, bitch. Just watch me. Who's there? I'm the Grand Master of- Oh, someone was making Keebler Elf strings. I don't know what those are, but that's what they were making. Black Radiant. All right. That's Alanis Morissette screaming at us. She's like, stop singing my songs. God damn it. Is that the best you can do? I don't know why she's an old woman. An old man, actually. Mr. Cuddlesworth is unconscious. Seems he's been drinking too much. Yes, take that, Professor Mustache. Alright, everyone, let's keep moving. Oh, that is gonna get so annoying. Son of a bitch. Okay, we need level two. Where did his. Where did Cuddle. Alright, everyone, we're going to the big bad building of Belancas here. Locked, not for long. Damn it. Locked, slightly longer. There we go, see? Freeze! Um, box. Freeze, box. Box, please freeze. Mr. Cuddlesworth is unconscious. Mr. Cuddlesworth is unconscious. Mr. Cuddlesworth is unconscious. <laughs> supposed to be eating this pancake bottle. Who's there? Is this door open? Oh god, it does. Hello there, you. Oh no, my head. Good thing you ducked so I could shoot the back of your head better. Dickweed. Right. Hey, it's Alanis Morissette. Yeah. Oh, look at Hard Hat Man. Thinking he's so cool. You're not cool. You're dead. Good job, everyone. Except for Cuddles, because he's unconscious constantly, forever. You. You. Okay, let's, um. Let's get over here. And then to the folks at R&D presently working at our fine facility, welcome, I'm Claire McMamus, Foundry Supervisor. I hope the boys and girls have made you feel at home. If not, point them out and I'll give them to work with an angle, and I'll get to work with an angle grinder. Ha ha, kidding. Yeah, don't take it personally if this place is a little informal. We run a tight ship, but without rods up our asses. If you need anything, you can get hold of us, hold of from the armory. Just let me know or drop a line to the any of the folks here. Oh, and a little safety tip. Hard hats at all times on the foundry floor, okay? You really don't want your heads grilled because you walked under a smelting pot. Just ask John, smoking hole for a head dough. 
Hope to talk to you and all in the person. Private log. Oh, God. Feel the love. Aha, victory is mine, mine, and Ricky's. Brass quashed the bat on the mixed washrooms. Finally, it's not like we can work all day and have to scrub up in wash basins. Why Bill and Maud got it into their heads that not walking around stinking of ass was a bad thing is beyond me. Oh, well, at least the means the washrooms are going to be packed tonight. Makes me wish I'd brought a camera down here. Bad vibes. I don't know what's going on around here until a few days ago. Morale was solid. No fights, no disciplinary actions. Well, I guess I may have to talk about all the bunking up. We're running out of condoms. <laughs> no, nothing. Now we've got Maud and Bill flipping out and throwing chairs and bringing in raccoons and dressing them up like babies. Some kind of scare. Lots more orders coming through plus staff turnarounds next week. Probably some stress. Playing a hunch. Well, where to begin? A couple of days ago, the new staff came in on Rhoda and came along for the ride with some new guy from, from for the R&D team. No big surprises there. A few got called up to big moves <laughs> last week. Made sense. Today, this new guy shows up unannounced Dwight and demands we let him look over our output records. Naturally, Nod puts the kabush on, kab kab kabosh on that right away, but we check him out, and sure enough, he's here on business. Apparently, someone on his end has been selling off our output to some other third party. Damien Cheese. Dwight just wanted to see how bad the damage was, so I convinced Ricky to sneak in him after after. Sure enough, he was right. We've got everything from bootlaces to rocket launchers vanishing into a shell game of holding companies. I don't care if Maud buys my head off over this. We have to act now. The changes came from someone using an R&D access card. The new R&D guy is Damien, and he's here to cover his tracks. Just waiting on Maud to get security so we can nail this bucker. <laughs> Evacuation! To every resource, the facility has been compromised. We've had confirmations of a nuclear exchange topside, and the outlining Geiger counters are already picking up high rad levels beyond the threshold of our defenses. We're evacuating west to the closest logistics outpost. If the R&D team were taken hostage approximately four hours ago by a man we suspect of espionage. Damien Green, a former associate of his, Dwight York, and the rest of the R&D team are currently sealed in the armory with him. As far as we know, the 10mm concept prototype <gasps> is still intact. We have no time to attempt to override the lock from our side, but a salvage team should be able to access it with the proper clearance. Good luck, whoever you are. Claire McManus Anus. And flooding. That was... Keep searching away, boys and girls. Okay. Uh, there's somewhere I need to go. Okay. Some come in through here. Aha! Oh, oh, this would surely kill me like a child. Like a child. Okay. Let's go down. Where is this thing? It's there. Oh my god. Is it in there? I don't understand. And that is getting really annoying. Um, let's see if we can... We're not going to be able to fix this. Because everyone's going to do a block party run into the lava. Steve, don't come in the lava. I'm a god right now. Don't come in the lava, bud. Cuddles, where are you? I'm in Jesus mode. Ball arms, don't get in the goddamn lava. Ball arms. No, Sky. Everyone, get out of the lava. God damn. Cuddles, where are you? Now Cuddles is no longer... There he is. What happened? Why is everyone god now? Only I'm supposed to be god mode. Alright, everyone, get up here. Oh, it's because collision mode is off, that's why. Hey, everyone, get the hell over here. God. <laughs> Lol. Everyone out of the fires of death? Hey, Sky. Hey, Sky, maybe you should get out of the goddamn fire, hey? Hey, bud. Thank you. Ball arms. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. Thank you so much. All right, we're all up in dups. All right, good. I'm gonna turn off the god mode. Good job, everyone. We did good. Thank you, Cuddles. I appreciate you uh, not burning alive. Oh, hi there. How are you? I'll just take everything, whatever. Um. Ugh. All right, we'll be back. All right, this guy had it the whole time. He had it. Professor uh, Top Hat had it. 
God damn nice it. work. At least we stopped these cretins from tearing the place down themselves. Yes. This cinches it. After we get clearance, we're shutting this place down permanently. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why do we have to blow this place up? Orders are orders. If Lockhart wants me to stand on one leg and whistle Dixie, I'd do it. I don't think. I'm not saying we're not going to take the time to gut this place of anything valuable, but don't get your hopes up. No secret hidey holes. I mean, other than mine. Fine, what's next? Now we need the clearance code to upgrade this to a level 3. Not sure how we're going to find it. Best to start poking around these restricted areas, see if there's anything to go on. Gonna go poke around some secret alien places. 